impressive, Commander. The Geth squadrons attacking our live ships have been completely neutralized. If there is any chance we could duplicate the feat, I would be happy to lend my expertise. Legion's the one to ask if you're looking for other servers. I thought as much, but your Geth claims to have no data available whenever I inquire. Perhaps you can help me with something else. What's that? How did you get Geth Primes to work with you? They volunteered. I see. Well, should you wish to examine these Geth to confirm their new allegiance, please do not hesitate to contact me. Zen out. Commander, we've located the Reaper base transmitting the local signal. Good. And not a moment too soon. With the Reaper code upgrades, the Geth are tearing the fleet apart. Once the signal is disabled, the Geth will pose no threat to Creator forces. You sound conflicted. While the old machines have unethical purposes, their upgrades have vastly improved our people. Observe. A Geth processing signal. A single unit, I believe. Correct. Now, ten nearby units networked cooperatively. Now, a single Geth unit with the old machine upgrades. That's a fully evolved AI. Yes. We do not agree with the goals of the old machines, but we find this growth... beautiful. Indicative of life. It is. Commander! I witnessed their history, Admiral. The Reapers sped up the process, but the Geth were always moving this way. And they will die when we destroy the base. They allied with the Reapers. To save themselves from you. Maybe they don't have to die. After what I saw on that server. I don't know. Maybe there's another option. Commander? Are you suggesting... I'm not suggesting anything. All I'm saying is maybe they don't all have to die. It's a moot point until we take out that base. The surrounding area is heavily fortified. And they have placed jamming towers to prevent orbital targeting. Sounds like we're going in on foot. Admiral Zen developed a laser guidance system that can cut through the jamming. It's synced to the Normandy's targeting computer. So the Normandy launches a precision strike at whatever target I have painted? That ought to do it. Edie, this work for you? Yes. It should enable us to make a precision strike against the Reapers. And anything else in our way? The Geth will quickly reconfigure their jamming towers to neutralize this technology. You should not use it before reaching the base. I've sent the coordinates for the Reaper base. Are we clear to go? We still haven't gotten a rescue ship to Admiral Kors. Can he wait? We're suffering heavy civilian casualties without him there to organize them. But we'll do what we can. This is your operation, Commander. If you want to strike now, you've got my support. I gave in to your reckless behavior before, Han. The Potter fleet isn't moving. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigates time to make repairs. And then you'll charge off again, like last time. This is different, Ron. Unless we give our ships time to rest, we're gonna lose them. So, pull them back. If I withdraw now, the guests will flank us, and we'll lose any room to maneuver. I need the patrol fleet. I gave in to your reckless behavior before, Han. The patrol fleet isn't moving. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigates time to make repairs. And then you'll charge off again, like last time. This is different, Ron. Admiral Garrel's right. Withdrawing now puts the whole fleet at risk. As you say, Commander. All right, Han. You've got your ships. Thank you, Ron. You'll get them back in good condition. The data you forwarded about the Geth was... disturbing. It doesn't match the stories we tell. Having second thoughts about the Geth? Admirals don't have the luxury of second thoughts. What do you need? I'd like to know about your patrol fleet. In peacetime, the patrol fleet managed navigation, internal security, and intership conflicts or crimes. Now, we mostly guard the heavy fleet's flank. It's mostly light frigates or fighters. 
What can you tell me about Admiral Garrel's heavy fleet? It was our main military force before the war, comprised of all Korean vessels suited for sustained combat. It can't compare to the Turian forces, of course, but we have a number of heavy frigates and advanced fighter forces. Tally said you had the largest fleet in the galaxy. The Turians have more dreadnoughts. Their overall military force is larger than our heavy fleet by far. But before we began this war, we jury rigged every Quarian ship in the flotilla for battle. Even our live ships have cannons. You've converted them into dreadnoughts. That's a violation of the Treaty of Ferrixen. Why live ships have firepower comparable to a dreadnought? Their primary purpose is food cultivation. You think the Council will buy that technicality? If need be. I'll apologize once this war is over. And in the meantime, you're putting your civilians in danger. Not casually, Commander. We keep them off the front lines, but we'll do whatever we must to win. I'll let you get back to work. Thank you, Commander. Shepard Commander, we have re-established a connection with Gath liberated from the server. What's their status? We have integrated their programs into this platform's network with minimal difficulties. Your actions have changed their perspective on organics. They also offer gratitude. We'll talk later. We will remain here. I'm ready to hit the Reaper base whenever you are, Shepard. Talk to you later, Tally. Sure. Shepard, you are now possibly the only living organic who has experienced the Geth Consensus. Do you feel different? It's fascinating. Mind-blowing. I'm also a bit thirsty. And just like that, the magic is gone. Did you just say what I think you said? No. Hello, Shepard. So you went into the Geth Consensus? Like virtual reality? Yeah, it was strange, but I got out all right. Did you? I mean, how would you know? How would I know what? If you really got out. See, if the Geth experience everything virtually, then you could only think you're in the real world. What if this, like everything you're seeing now, is a simulation? Commander? Commander, you might want to check in on Commander Williams down on the observation deck. Commander, there's a new message at your private terminal. The Allied Primes are relaying any hostile combat data they can decrypt. I never thought I'd be linking Geth into the system. Commander? Williams? Oh. What have we here? Ma'am, I'm off duty. Your voice? Ma'am, not so loud. Please, thank you. Why are you curled up on the floor? 
Am I? Oh, my head. So heavy. Can't move. Ah. Uh, enjoy your evening? I'll be back to work in 30. Maybe 40. I swear. Just give me 45 minutes. Shh. How did you end up in this sorry state? Just wanted to let off some steam. Vega said he had just the thing to take my mind off stuff. And did that thing come in a bottle? Yes. This empty bottle? It's empty. Oh boy. Is it time to test the fire alarm? You know, I think it is. I'll pay you a million credits not to do that, ma'am. Two million and we have a deal. <sighs> You're a damn space pirate. I could order Joker to sing to you over the comm. I hate you. I hate you... Ma'am. As you were, Williams. Mmm. -hmm. Cold floor. Oh, oh. Oh. Hmm. Cold floor. Oh. Okay, you can go now. Oh. Okay, you can go now. So. Prothean, huh? Yes. You guys like to drink, booze it up? No. Okay. What about gambling? Play cards? Games of chance were punishable by death in the Empire. Oh, sure. Sure, that seems reasonable. Okay. So, smoking. You ever do that? Only when my armor became inflamed. Right. <laughs> yeah, smoking. I get it. So jokes then. You got jokes. All right. You got any good ones? No. Yes. Give them to me. The Tulomorian spy entered the enemy's camp and said to the Vankshire, I didn't know your parnaps could glow. Um... That was the joke. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. That was a good one. No, it wasn't. I just made it up. The joke is now on you, human. You will believe anything. <laughs> this platform can be of some assistance, Garrus Vicarian. I appreciate the offer, Legion, but this is something I know a thing or two about. Telemetry data indicates the calibration of Normandy's weapon accuracy can be improved by 0.32%. That's all? You can't squeeze 0.34% out of it? Negative. That threshold is not possible. You sure? Take a look now. Scanning. Normandy's weapon systems have been improved by a margin of 0.43%. How did you accomplish this? A little secret we organics like to keep. Always hold some back for emergencies. Is our current situation an emergency? A geth meddling with our computers, telling me how to do my job? No, I can't imagine that would qualify. So, a virtual geth reality, huh, Shepard? There are a lot of ways I can think of getting a few kicks in this universe. That's not one of them. Another time, maybe. I had hoped the Geth would have analyzed any Prothean technology they came across. You're saying you found none? No. On this topic, our knowledge is not significantly greater than your own. That's too bad, but thank you for looking. Shepard Commander placed faith in us. We will do the same for Normandy. You mean the Normandy's crew? We do not see a meaningful distinction. Hello again. Thank you. 
Hello again. Please enjoy your day. Hey, Commander. James, what are you up to? A little cooking. Hope you don't mind. I was craving some of my abuelas huevos rancheros. I'm not sure what kind of eggs these are, but they seem to work. Oh, if you see Ash anywhere, tell her I'll save her some. I'm thinking she might need a little nourishment after last night. I don't think she's in any position to eat right now. That's too bad. This is just what she needs. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm! Not as good as my abuelas, but best thing I've had since I got on board. And maybe it's best I don't know what kind of eggs these are, no? Hey, Commander. You took a great risk in allowing a machine access to your mind, Commander. What if they had infected you? I do not think this James soldier understands me. None of these cycles seem to understand me. And I do not care. Not at this time. Everything okay, Shepard? Ma'am. Thank <laughs> you. 